What's going on guys and welcome back to the channel in today's video we have we're going to be playing with Inform Muriel if you know back in FIFA 14 or 15 Muriel was one of the most overused cards in FIFA and he was an 80 rated player and I think he, there was the likes of Ivarbo he was also a lot of a lot of people was using him and Adrian Ramos the Borussia Dortmund player so there is a bunch of Colombian players that have been overpowered back in FIFA 14 or 15 so this is the thing that we're going to be playing we're going to be playing the tour the knockout tournaments and uh, it was a team that I think some of the players I already play with them but I didn't know I had Perotti the Roma player the left mid so I put a hunter card on him so to boost that pace and shooting but the rest of the players I know they were played that they were good but I changed my formation in game so this is Muriel I took this from footbin.com and I put a hog a hog chemistry style on him and it boosts his pace his shooting and physicality and I wanted the especially because of his physicality now his strength is like 79 aggression is 66 but again it's, it, it could be better but the his pace and his shooting are really really good so this is the first opponent that we came up with and I something that I read that you always gonna notice on Muriel is his pace but what's having pace with no physicality especially in this FIFA but with Muriel his physicality is great especially this strength so it's going to be hard to put to take out the ball out of Muriel uh, and, and even if you have a great defender I didn't I didn't come up against Boateng so I don't know how it would be like to play uh, Muriel against Boateng so I think he will it would be hard to take the ball out of Muriel but it's still like he's a really good player his agility is great so you can go even if you change formations uh, to the flies use one striker if you want to play Muriela maybe as a left forward or right forward he will work great on those positions so I, I switched to the 4 triple 2 on in game um, especially because I also wanted to try uh, Perotti as a cam and again like I, I didn't feel that formation like even though we're winning we're scoring a lot of goals but I didn't feel it but Muriel was scoring a lot of goals for me and also he was assisting my player so I'm not also going to be showing the goals that I scored Muriel I'm also going to be showing other goals with the other players and also when he assisted some of my players so I really like how he play uh, we don't have to I, I like when if I play with two strikers I like to have one big striker like uh, that's why I play Lukaku or some other players but in this Calcio I, there is not a, a player that you can compare to Lukaku so um, I had to play with Ivala even though they work out fine but I had to change my gameplay a little bit I, I didn't cross the ball too, too many times and I, w I was making a lot of passes uh, going in front so if I play with Lukaku I try to push uh, I had to shield the ball but with the players that I have uh, it was kind of impossible so I had to change my gameplay a, li a little bit so I think the guy Reshqui I think we put like four goals and he just left and this is the second match again uh, I don't know if they were in foot champions before I don't know they were some good players uh, we get we got into the final and the final was tough so we started losing against this opponent and again his agility his pace everything about Muriel I did not I don't know how his heading is just because I didn't cross it to him uh, and but still like he's a really good uh, player he's not that sure I think he's like 5 11 5 10 but still like, if you want to try to cross it I think he will catch up to, to the ball but not most of the time so I don't think it will be great to cross the ball to Muriel but if you have a physical guy maybe you play Mansukish uh, with Muriel that could be a great partnership I didn't try it just because I don't know I don't like uh, Mansukish in this game so much so uh, that was a, a goal that was scoring a penalty and I don't know how that went in like the goalkeeper saved it but still he went in so here like he was trying to push the, uh, to to, uh, to take the ball on Muriel even though he almost worked but his strength is so good that he he, all, he found a way to just put it back in the net so he's really good player to have and he's really really cheap I got him for 20,000 coins and I think it's because a lot of people open a lot of packs during this weekend so there is a bunch of Muriels in the market so you can get this guy for like 20,000 coins 
I don't think it will be a great investment uh, to sell them later on just because there is just a lot of players, uh, a lot of reels in the market which I think his price is going to settle like 22, 23 maybe, 23k so but I don't think it will be a great investment to have but still he is a great player if you run a cash away in, uh, as your regular team I think it will be a great improvement maybe if you play somebody uh, Jay Valla is good, but I don't like Higuain in this in this FIFA. I know a lot of people know how to use Higuain, but personally, I don't like Higuain. But if you like to try Daivala or Muriel, or maybe if you play with a cam, you can use uh, Daivala as a cam, Muriel in one side, and or Salah as a striker as well, which which is really good. So there is a bunch of formations that you can use just uh, to put a uh, uh, Muriel in your team. So this is the semi-final. He was using in Muriel as well but he was using the 4-3-2-1 formation but still we find you always find a way to find Muriel and use uh, his finishing is great guys especially with the hook uh, chemistry style on him so it was just really really fun to use this player I know it didn't come out against great opponent most of the time uh, well, like very competitive opponent we didn't play any division one with this team but still it, it's a player that it could work the team not so much like the team that I was running it was great but of course I would put some other players in those positions for me Cuadrado is someone that really works but I think Salah would be better uh, I think Salah is more overpowered than Cuadrado I think it's because of the physicality as well so if you run the second in form Salah that would be great for you Guys. So again, guys, uh, I don't know why we, how did he miss that shot? Like, I thought it was going in, but at the end we missed it. And again, I was making so many mistakes in this game that uh, the two goals that he scored they were my mistakes, and, and that's something that I always do. That uh, that it cost me games, even on free champions. So that's something that I have to work on my gameplay. So now we are after we after he scored, we straight went back into the game and. We scored a third goal with Nain Golan, which I really like his car. I was really wanted to get his uh, second in form, but it's just too expensive. But again, I don't run a casual team like most of the time, so it wouldn't be worth it for me to buy him. So this is the final. This guy was really good, guys. He, he, he was really a hard, even his defense, his defense, he was really good at defense. But at the 42nd minute, uh, just look at this goal from Muriel. He can also take long shots, guys. Guys, he's just an amazing player. So you can take long shots. Uh, his finishing is good. His physicality is great. So his dribbling agility. So he's an amazing player overall, guys. He's a great, great player to have. If you want a team to have fun, or if you wanna just have fun on seasons, or to go on the knockout at tournaments, he's a great player to have in your team. If you, if you really want to have fun, I don't know how he will perform for champions because that that's different. But I, I used uh, a Syria team uh, at the beginning in FIFA and I went on for champions and I played with his regular card and it was working fine so his regular card it was perfect for me at the beginning and for champions so now with with an informed card which feels way way better I think he will be great for your casual team if you play on for champions I, I'm really comfortable saying that because uh, how how I play and how he plays in game, it was just amazing guys. So this is the team guys, uh, give him a shot, put him, if you want, you can make a hybrid around him. Uh, you can use some co other Colombian players, so if you use legends, so it will be, he can fit in a lot of teams guys. So he's a great player to have and just give him a shot guys. So thank you guys for watching and i see you guys later. Thank you.